I'm happy to hear you enjoyed Firefox. Yeah, let's just get right into it, actually. There's no need to delay anything. Uh, the music that I enjoyed, I like it as well. I think that's what you're saying with that. Um, I hope the sound's all right. I do have the mic a little further away than uh, I tend to, just because it's easier to... It seems really inconvenient to play, is the bottom line. So it's much easier if it's just not in the way of me pressing the keyboard so much. Um, I can dance at this for ages. It, it hasn't got um, old for me yet. Okay, well, let's let's start before it completely reloops. So let's just continue. Um, yes, yeah, we've streamed this. This is the eighth stream, and I still enjoy it. So it's probably not going to get that old. Um, we had a, a bit of a hiccup yesterday, but uh, it was nothing major. We got through some more uh, fates. Also, Farvox, have you watched any of the... I mean, it's nice to have you here again. But, um, have you watched any of the Oberdin streams? Otherwise, this might be quite confusing. Something I wanted to explore immediately... Oh yeah, I should probably... Actually, it's fine if you haven't, because I wanted to give a rundown of what we know so far. I've seen this before. Okay, that's cool. But I'm gonna just run through what we know already. Um... Where do I start? Okay. Let's start with the first chapter, Loose Cargo. So, this is the earliest event uh, of the, what you can say, you can call it the, yeah, I'm going to get into literary terms here, but when you have a story, you have something that's called the Fabula and the Shizet. Um, the Fabula is basically the, yeah, that's exactly it. The Fabula is basically the actual story at face value, like the facts in chronological order, and the Shizet is the way that is presented, the order in which it is presented to either the reader, the viewer, or in this case, the player. So, this whole game is basically a gimmick on the sujet and figuring out yourself, but we have got a pretty good idea, uh, idea of the fabula uh, so far, with like one big gap, but we can basically run through it and see what the actual timeline of events was. So, starting with Loose Cargo, that's the first chapter, the boat, the Oberdin, started in Europe, uh, specifically what became the United Kingdom. This game takes place long before that, I believe. Um, I think it would just be called Britain. And... Yeah, is it Britain? It's the Indian Britain a trading company, I can't remember now. So they started here, and the first death was one Samuel Peters who was crushed by fallen cargo. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. And when that fell as well, there was actually a stowaway in one of the barrels and they died. Nothing of huge significance there. Next chapter, we they've made some a distance from uh, uh, Britain. Now they're closer to the Madeira um, and this lower part of Europe when we entered the bitter cold which is basically when a terrible um, coldness was about and some crewmates started dying from sickness such as one Solomon uh, Syed I don't actually know how to pronounce that too well everyone died in this game exactly it's like insert movie that gets spoiled by that statement just insert movie just anything you can say whatever you want there uh, so basically, he died from a sickness. Uh, then Renfred Rajub also died from uh, a sickness. It probably wasn't contagious, uh, as they say in one of the transcripts here, I believe. Some lung disease, not consumption, made worse by the cold. Um, will it spread? If so, we'd all have it. So no. So basically, this guy just died. Also, he died while they were having that conversation, which is pretty, pretty ironic and sad. Um... Yeah, basically. Uh, not necessarily pirates, just uh, sailors. So, yeah. Um, but that's that's the idea. So, he died from like a similar illness from the cold. 
then they killed a large cow that wasn't actually a member of the crew. Uh, it was just showing the midshipman the ropes, as that's what a midshipman is there to learn. Uh, and that was the end of that chapter. Then, the first bit of real spice happens with the murder. Let's see where they were. So they had uh, gone past and they were now by the Canary Islands. Uh, Nunzio Pasqua, who was an Italian passenger, was killed by Edward Nichols. For what reason? I'm not sure. I believe... It was um, I think um, at this point they were transporting a shell a very valuable shell from the Formosa or Formosa uh, let me get that right before I sound very silly do 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 yeah, I, I, um, a Formosan treasure, I believe, is what they were transporting. And I think Edward Nichols, who was the second mate, got a bit greedy and wanted to steal it from the storage. And Nunzio Pasqua just happened to be there. Or oh, Pasca, I'm not entirely sure. Then, um, Edward Nichols framed uh, Hock Seng Lao, who was killed by a firing brigade. And then after that, uh, Edward Nichols was fleeing the boat, taking the Formosan royalty uh, with him uh, in a bid to steal the shell uh, once and for all. I believe that's what's happened. Okay, then we go on to the next one, which is the calling. So Edward Nichols, I believe, returns. I'm not entirely sure about exactly what happens here. But basically... Um, or... Or they were leaving. Actually, I think they were just leaving. Um, and then they were attacked by monsters. So, this guy who was loyal to Edward Nichols, I'm not entirely sure who he actually is. He might be Alexander Booth. That's just who I've put as a placeholder. Um, on the off chance that that's right. It's definitely a Russian. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not a Russian, but there's a Russian there. Then they were attacked as they were leaving. Um, one of the stewards, who I believe is Samuel Galligan, uh, was also killed. There. Um, then Ban Lam Lin, who was the part of the one of the Formosan royals, uh, was killed also in that attack. It Bang, the other royal, was killed as well. Uh, he died because of like the shell. Then Edward Nichols was shot by someone. I just put uh, Olius, excuse me, Olus uh, Weater here for no reason. Uh, it probably wasn't actually him. I can probably tell you exactly who it was. Uh, it was Philip Dahl. I can put that down right away. That's free. Uh, and then two people went missing. I think they fell overboard. Okay, so the people who attacked them as they were leaving were like these soldiers of the sea kind of I don't know they're like mermaid people um, and they basically came on board as well and started attacking people uh, and killing them so people fought back I don't know if we can get a good image of that doesn't seem like it but people started fighting back some people died um, and they managed to basically uh, kind of kill them, but they weren't really dead. So people were transporting them down into... Uh, yeah, I know. Okay. I'm just going over the whole thing for myself and also for viewers and also VOD. You know, it's all going to be... We're just laying it out before we continue. They threw harpoons on, uh, on them. Yeah, basically. Some sort of spear harpoon thing. Uh, so... Where was I? Oh yeah, so they were transporting them down to cargo. Some of them came back to life and started... Um, yeah, that whole thing killed a few people. And then for some reason, uh, Philip Dahl killed John Naples. Not really clear on why that one happened. Um, so then, now that these people had awoken, they started attacking them on the ship. And this guy got electrocuted in a storm. Um... He got attacked, so they started just basically killing people because they were now these captives. 
so a few people died. Yeah, it's basically just this long pin of death. The Holy Harpoon of Poseidon. Yes. That sounds about right. Um, yeah, so people just kept dying in this attack. Uh, this guy was killed through the door, I believe. Oh yes, and this and a bunch of people teamed up and managed to kill one, but unfortunately the carpenter died. It's actually quite sad. Then, once that was done, uh, people started trying to escape. Because they figured we should leave this boat. Uh, one of them killed the other because he thought uh, it was his fault that his brother died. That was uh, Nathan Peters killed uh, Lars Lindt. Um, and this is when the Kraken attacked. So, Edward Spratt, who was the artist, was uh, doing his business and it got attacked by the Kraken. Then the Kraken started attacking uh, more of the ship. And people just started dying. People died in an explosion from one of the cannons. Um, loose cannons were falling and killing people. He was eaten by, or oh, no, blasted by an explosion when they were attacking the Kraken. Uh, this guy got torn apart, Maba. Rip. Seems to be like the most helpful guy who was there. And then Abigail got killed by uh, the beast as well. And then people disappeared. A bunch of them. So these people probably escaped. Uh, in that first uh, boat that was going away. The bargain we don't know anything about. And it seems to take place almost simultaneously with the, the Kraken thing. Because immediately after the attack, Alfred uh, Klestel, the bosun, dies because he was attacked and he bled out. Uh, someone was trying, a group of people were trying to take the last boat, and so one of the Russians killed uh, Paul, and uh, yeah, he just straight up died. <laughs> then the guy who uh, attacked him got shot by one of the passengers who was leaving. Meanwhile, through this whole thing, uh, one of the midshipmen had heard that some of the crew members were planning essentially a coup against the captain and he uh, went to go yell about it uh, through that the uh, gunner's mate got killed by the uh, fourth mate after he'd stabbed one of the mid that, that midshipman then because he had stabbed him um, Henry Brennan who's the first mate's friend and the first mate uh, really were the people who were left with the captain. The first mate and this guy, uh, Henry Brennan, were left with the captain and ultimately just wanted to take what he had left and sell it off before they left the ship. So he clubbed him because he killed people. Uh, he dies by bleeding out after he was stabbed. And then those people at the start uh, managed to leave. And then the end is pretty straightforward. Uh, they want to have the last of the captain's belongings so they can sell them before they leave. And then the captain shoots the first mate. First mate's friend, Henry Brennan, goes in and he gets uh, killed by the captain again. This guy, who I don't know, uh, also gets killed by the captain. And then the captain kills himself. And that's the end. So, that's what we know has happened so far. So let's solve some more fates today. The first one I want to get straight uh, is kind of this one. Actually, I'm pretty sure I've already figured it out just by going through everything. Uh, it wasn't by... It was uh, Philip Dahl. Where is Philip Dahl? Then I should be pretty certain about two of them. If not three, we'll see. Yeah, pretty certain about that one. Um, so the next one that I get right should activate. Uh, because I'm quite, I'm quite sure about this. Maybe we can revisit the... Okay. Maybe we can visit his death to just uh, make sure that he died the way that we think he died. Uh, we can do that by going here. So yeah, there's the story so far. Ahoy! They're back. <laughs> They're back. Now I understand it. Wait, don't shoot. I have treasure. I yield. Hold your fire. <laughs> nah, still shot him anyway. Just want to confirm that it is actually Philip Dahl. No, it isn't. It was the it was the guard. Okay, so we can actually immediately fix that. Uh, is that Philip Dahl? Who's there? I'm kind of just floating around, aren't I? 
No, that was the fourth mate, I think. So where was Philip Dahl through all this? Oh, there he is. I think. Is that him? Must be. Okay. These people are all dead. So I can fix this uh, right now, actually. It wasn't Philip Dahl who shot him. It was... Which one? I need to check who this is. Uh, I can do that just by doing this. Uh, it was Chio Tan. So he just stuck around, I guess. He must have been really angry because he stole... Um, uh, Edward Nichols just took the Formosan royalty away. Uh, so if we exit here, then we just say that it was... Uh, was it Chio Tan? Yeah, I think so. So, yeah. Is it? Is it? Am I right? About who I said it was? Yeah. We know it's, that's definitely him. So. so that's definitely right. 100%. No doubt. Um, who's the next death that we can look at? So the next one I'm certain about. Uh, yeah. No worries. Um, let's see. The next one... So basically, if I know two for certain, then I can um, kind of cheese one that I'm not sure about until it's right. So I'm pretty sure about this one. Not sure about this one. I kind of just want to put whoever's name there. Uh, I'll also do it for that one. Could say like him. Yep, there we go. <laughs> it worked. See, I didn't even have to think. Just like that. We are not digital beings like you. Yeah, I'm. I'm not real. Um. Cool. Immediately, just three more like that. I don't actually have a life out of streaming. In case you guys didn't know. Don't believe any streamer who says otherwise. They are only there for your entertainment. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just I'm just being a clown. Um, cool. So we got those. Uh, what's the next one that we can do then? Uh, let's actually see. Have we completed? No, we haven't completed uh, this chapter of the calling. So we got it right, uh, just by guessing. That was Li Hong. Um, don't know who this one is. It's not a Russian. It's an Englishman. Uh, do I have any other memories of this guy? Yeah. Well, no, no, uh, not three people, right? Well, I do have three people, right? But if I have two that I'm certain of, then I can basically just, if there's one that I have no idea, I'll just go through every single, like, basically I'm using it as just an opportunity to, um, lockpick. You know, when you just go through every combination, because one of them is going to be free, essentially. If you're certain, if you have all the evidence for the other two, then it's pretty easy. Because if I, if I just do all the easy ones, um, then I'll be left with, like, the hardest ones at the end. And that's not really what I want to do. I want to get some of them just as freebies, in a way. Do I have any other... Okay, you perished in this one. Uh, use one of the... Seamen. Seamen. I know I'm saying that a little bit strangely. Just ignore that. Uh, he is English, I believe. Could be George Shirley. Um, apparently there's some evidence for figuring out who he is. He doesn't have a... doesn't have a... Is this... Who's this? Is this death? Uh, I don't need that one. Uh, it's not three people per memory. It's it's three people per confirmation, essentially, because a memory can have a lot of people. Just to be clear, um, I think that's what you meant. But uh, I just wanted to make sure that no one was confused. Where's the where's the guy who died? Oh wait, wait, he disappeared. No, did he? Where is he? Oh, he must have died earlier. Yeah. 
Let me go to his death then. Because he died first. So that guy will still be around. Let's go here. Oh, I went to the wrong one. We can go backwards, it's fine. We'll just backtrack. I seem to skip it. Cool. So this is this guy. This is her. Yeah, I need to go back. I need to go back quite a few. It was like drag people overboard, if I remember, after they killed them. So that's why I can't find their corpses just yet. Let me get my volume pretty nice. Yeah, that's that's better. Nope, still keeps talking. That's not fun. Okay, so he pulls in their souls or something. I don't know, that, one, that one's pretty wacky. Uh, whose death is uh, that one? I'm gonna check. Yeah, this is the this is the one I want to check. Anyway, hello, oh, come on. There we go. Weird little uh, boxes there. Weird uh, boundaries. So there's a Russian with them. Something there. That's not English. Give us a weapon. Is it the last one you spoke that died? No. Give us a weapon. Okay, so it's not the Russian. Give us a weapon. It's not English. That was a mistake on my part. Definitely not English. I don't think he's that. Um, I do believe he is a seaman. No, it's, no. Nah. Okay. Let's try him. No. Let's try him. No. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Quite sure about this one. It may take forever to die, yeah. It can be a little bit, uh... can take some time. Um... Were you already here? Yes, I believe you were. I believe you were the guy who was right in front of him, right? Yeah. You... Might have been the one who was speaking Russian. But you just disappeared then, right? This is... yeah, this is Nichols. This guy was already dead. It's him. Um... yeah. Okay, this is... Samuel, I believe. Is this? Oh, actually, this is one of the Russians. This is definitely one of the Russians. Uh, sure. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that, but if you want to share, go ahead. Um. Does it have anything to do with Genshin Impact? Probably drowned by the beast. Let me try some of the other Russians. No. No. Are there any other Russians? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Dragon Ball Legends, are, I do recall. Yeah, he's probably not Persian. 
For sure he's one of the Russians. Just say he's... Who's the other one who disappeared? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. That uh, the cool guys are coming out when school starts. When will that be? I'm guessing... No, I, I don't know. January? Uh, okay, wait. Nichols. Oh, that's rough. Doesn't seem super uh, productive. Let me see this death. Now who's this? All right, the royalty. Come, come on. But yeah, I'm really sorry to hear that, Firefox. I don't think that's really cool of parents to do, just cut off internet. I think that's a little extreme. Managed to survive that somehow. guys appear in what I want to know is do these guys both appear in um particular chapter I want to look at is the bitter cold yes They are, so all the Russians are here. We can confirm that. Um, my advice, if you want any consolation, Firefox, would just be to um, try to make the most of the time that you have and find something that you can enjoy in the meantime. I would personally promote reading, but I know that's not everyone's cup of tea. So all the Russians are here. Um, I think we can knock them all out. I'm gonna say drowned by a beast. Oh, that's what I wanted. Um, so what if I swap these? No. Uh, I must be wrong about all of them then. Hmm, interesting. Okay, well, let me try saying top man here. Mm. 
No. Who's the remaining Russian? Apparently not. Let's see if we can get it right one more time. Excuse me. Say this is the top man. Say this is that. Say he is I guess this guy. One of these has to be correct. Maybe I'm wrong about the cause of death. Maybe they didn't drown. Let me just let me go to the next the next death. Let me try this. It's a little difficult to navigate to all the the deaths that I want to. But let me try this. Uh, where's the woman? It's this one. I'm going to. Yeah, impressive. Let me see his death. This is the death I wanted to see. The death at sea. Oh, Hagen. Oh, Hagen. Uh, let me just see who's speaking there. Okay, so now that I understand it a bit more, I can confirm that I got the cause of death wrong, but I can also say, oh, Hagen, are you still breathing? This was not oh, Hagen, that's for sure. Are you oh, Hagen? Let's see who's present. Could be O'Hagan. O'Hagan. But I can also change this face. I think he was strangled. By. Um. Read the form. It. Bing, yeah, I believe. Yeah, that's his name. Okay, so that's what happened there for sure. Otherwise, O'Hagan was the guy. Otherwise, this was O'Hagan. Might have been. No, it wouldn't have been that easy. Who had, who was an easy deduction? Must have been him. So this must have been O'Hagan. Who was present at the beginning? This is Nichols, definitely not O'Hagan. Your deduction rate's too high for it to just be a name that was said out loud. Maybe it's you. Your name is also, you also have a high deduction rate, so it's probably not you. I think this is O'Hagan. I think, 
Yeah, they do qualify them as terrible beasts. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is O'Higgin. And he did get harpooned. Um, I'm quite sure about this one. Let's just cycle through some names here. No. Hmm. Someone spoke Russian. I think this is my chance to get these Russians. They definitely did drown. I don't know what other fate I can put for them. Uh, they're definitely not alive. Might have been... Clawed. No. Let's try a different uh, death. Oh, there we go. Three more fates correct. It worked. Hey! Got all of them. Okay, apparently... I'm not getting... Uh, that guy's death correct. Apparently, you're not Samuel Galligan. But you were someone... You're one of the stewards. Maybe you're... No, definitely not. I'm quite sure you're, Sam you're Samuel Galligan. I'm I'm quite sure about that. Who else could you be? Not a top man. L looking at your outfit, I know for a fact. Not Paul Moss. Definitely not Davy Jones. Well, maybe. Oh, no, let's just try it for fun. No, I'm, I'm, I'm still pretty sure it's Samuel Galligan. You know, so we've got two of the Russians. Uh, who's the last Russian? Um, uh, bookmark memories. And if we go back here to a bit of cold, it was the first death. It was there. It was you, so you must be the last Russian. Yeah. Uh, Paul Moss was shot by Leonard Volkov then. Uh, we have to go to the escape. Leonard. It was Leonard Volkov. Yep, yeah, this is right. 
There aren't any other poles, eh? There's only one pole, yeah. Sure. So this one's definitely right. Let's cycle through some of the passengers. Um Jane Bird. Yeah. Oh it wasn't it wasn't Abigail, sorry, that was silly. Uh must be either Emily Jackson or uh, Miss Jane Bird. Who was there? Uh, he escaped. Where were they? I'm gonna check. So we were at the escape. They probably made it to the Madeira or the Canary Islands. So alive. So uh, we can put either this, this, Africa, of course. Alive on the Canary Islands. No, is alive on Africa. Yes. So they escaped Africa. We've got that. Cool. Great. We've got Emily Jackson right, even. Apparently, Samuel Galligan is just wrong. So, rip. But this this is helping a lot because that means I can. Okay, I don't know who this is. Oh wait, I do. <laughs> this is uh, definitely the fourth mate steward, um, and I believe you escaped to uh, Africa. And then. This is definitely Jackson, and you definitely escaped to Africa. Cool. And, yep. You escaped to Africa. And we did it. Nice. Just got all of those right. Just busted them out like that. It's that simple. It really is that simple. <laughs> Easy game, easy. Nice. What if you just complete it right here and now? Uh, let's escape. So that was all of um, escape. Cool. Uh, what more do we need to check? Okay. Who's this? What fate befell them? Uh, can I check your memories? Um, disappeared in the doom. Just bookmark your memories, please. Uh, looking at you, you look like a midshipman or a helmsman. How many midshipmen are left? None. Okay. Maybe you're the purser. Uh, this is in the doom. Probably drowned. Most likely. No one escaped. Uh, actually, wait. Hold on. Depends which one you were in. If you were in the first one, then you escaped for sure. Yes. Okay, I think this is the person just because we haven't seen anything more of him. Um, it's Nathan Peters. He escaped. All of these people escaped to the same place, and it would have been. Let's see how. Where were they? Probably the Canary Islands or Azores. Uh, either or. Let's try both. This unknown soul was blasted uh, with a cannon. We'll, we'll, we'll do that one in a second. Nathan Peters, you escaped. So alive. Uh, let's say the Canary Islands. 
live on the Canary Islands. Um, probably also Canary Islands. We just have to be consistent, and if it's wrong, then we just switch all of them. Um, and then also Canary Islands. Yeah. That wasn't that was minor, was it? Oh wait, we can figure out who Martin is. Let's go to Abigail's uh, death. She says, Martin, where is the captain? Have you lost your mind? Get back inside. I want my husband. He's below deck. Come here. Um, who do we know for sure? All three women here were there. This could have been Martin, but I don't think it is just because he's a pretty high deduction rate. There's a low deduction rate, not you. Uh, no, for certain though, Paul. Uh, it's Martin. Yeah, that's probably Martin. Oh, yes, yes, yes. D uh, definitely neither of these people are Martin. Um, so this is Martin, the third mate. Uh, that actually wasn't too bad. Don't know what happened to him though. Maybe he disappeared in the seventh chapter. We'll find out. Uh, he was here, so he probably drowned. Yeah, probably drowned. By a terrible beast. Um, who else was here? Uh, you probably also drowned then. No, he's not alive. He drowned. That one's... I'm quite certain about that one. Who's this? Uh, let's take a look. One of these three. Um... Probably drowned. Yep, there we go. Good guess, good guess for the top man. Yep, Finney Dalton. Probably also Charles Minor. Cool. We did it. We're, we're doing well. 45. Most of the way there. By a clean margin. Let's go back to the Doom. So I think I can do some clean up there. Still don't know about a bargain. Uh, not the purser. Uh, or I have the place wrong. So um, let me try switching the place to... Uh, as there is. And then you to as there is. Um hasn't worked yet. I don't have many left. Um could be Oh, he's probably Persian. Uh believe you were drowned by a terrible beast um were you in this last death is the question no you weren't where were you, you weren't here uh okay you weren't there you're here in the first one Did you just escape with them? 
No. Well, let's go to that death. I know how to get to that one. We're doing well, we're doing well. Don't have too many left. Let's see if we can um, uh, get even closer to our goal of getting all of them. Really, but we, we won't be able to get all of them because we don't know anything about uh, the bargain at the seventh chapter. But we can clean up the last of the chapters that we do uh, have for all the information about. I believe, where was it? Actually, it wasn't here. It was here. Was it? Or was it? Where was it? Oh, wait, maybe it was uh, up one. Yeah. It was through here. Check. This death. Hello? There we go. Uh, let's skip. Oh, great. We still have to hear it. Fantastic. Yeah, we still have to hear it. Awesome. Great. Um. Yeah, what a shame that that got cut off there. You're still alive here. Who are you? Oh, it's Paul Moss. Okay. Let's pull Moss. Okay, this is still happening. The audio is still running. Isn't that great? Okay, I know who that is, so I can probably guess who you are. Um, you were a friend of the other guy. Maybe you're. Jizang, or hmm, okay, we'd have the same job at the very least. So if I check, oh, it's not actually you. Come on, look, who are you? It is you. Hold on, maybe I'm in the wrong memory here. Yeah, I am. Oopsie. Uh, I have to look here. Uh, you were a top man. Okay, so probably also a top man then. You're hanging out with some people. You're probably not Chinese, but you're probably a top man. Could be, could be Lewis Walker. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Probably... There's, a, there's potential. Let's just check everyone else. This is... The fourth mate, yeah. Already got you. I'm looking for... Okay, someone's sleeping here. Number 56. Someone else sleeping here. Number 45. Oh, and two other people. Number 43 and 44. Um. Let's see. Uh, let me check out some of those, some of those numbers. So, 43 around this area. Okay, Maba was there. Lewis Walker wasn't awake. Check. Yeah, so, Lewis Walker was asleep. checking um some... let me check something 
I want to see your arm, can I? Apparently I can't. Um, and there's also someone sleeping here. Uh, number 10. Who's number 10? Um, apparently it's the... Fifty six and is fifty seven actually sleeping in there? Doesn't look like it. Uh fifty six though. Yeah. Fifty six. Is fifty six Ah, it's Henry. Crazy. Uh forty five is here. Forty five. Who is 45? Ah, it's, uh, Leonard. 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 Okay, so 43 is Maba, I believe. Yeah. 44 is Lewis Walker, so... Can't zoom in on him, unfortunately. But if I identify... I can identify almost everyone here. 41. Um, he's 41. Maybe they're just next to it, so. Oh, 41's uh, Wei Li, okay. So you, sir. We're talking to Wei Li, probably also a top man. Um, if I go back to this death, which is the second part of the doom. So I can identify almost everyone here. Yes, you were sleeping. I think you were sleeping. You you were sleeping. Where are you? Oh wait, maybe this is Lewis Walker then. Uh, try that. Um. You weren't sleeping. You're a top man. Maybe you're Thomas Sefton. Or top man. Uh, can't confirm. No. Alexander Booth. Perhaps. George Shirley. Yeah, there we go. Nice, 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 nice. That was George Shirley. Yes. And that was Lewis Walker. Okay. Nice. Let's try to bust out three more if we can. Um. Okay. Not the Ezra's. And not the Canary Islands. Try Africa. Um, then also for you, let's try Africa. Because. Uh, you, 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 you. Who are you? Where were you? Um, I believe you died on the boat. So we can say you drowned. Where is it? Drowned. Terrible beast. Hmm. Let's try that. Okay, any others that are just uh, easy to bust out? Uh, you... I'm quite certain are this person. Uh, I'd like to go back to your death because apparently I'm wrong. Uh, who's this? As 
Chinese man. No. Yeah. Uh, let's just go this one. Hmm. Let's try. No, that didn't work either. Oh, do you know? Maybe this person isn't the purser, but the chef. Hmm, I'm not sure. Let's just try. Um, actually, where do you appear? Six memories. Uh. Oh, and apparently they're the ones that are bookmarked. Experiences. Oh, you were here. So you say. No. Wait, right, the next page. Oh, maybe you did die. But where were you? Let me go to his death, perhaps. Um, do I know everyone here? First, let me just say before I leave. Let me verify that it's this death. Yes, know them, know them, know them, know them, know them. Uh, pretty certain. Yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, cool. I've got everything. I've got everything I can get from this. And uh, who's up here? Just a bunch of other people. Cool. Uh, yeah, I remember this death. Oh, wait. Here you are. No. Wrong person. Okay. Um, where can I leave from? I think it's this way. Technically, I'm over time, but let's 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 see if we can just pop out a few more, uh, just very quickly. You know, just a few more. I'm on a I'm on a good roll here. So, uh, where am I? This way. Uh, let me go up and inspect Abigail's death again. Or oh, no, uh, Mother's death might be better. Um, where is he? No. Here it is. Up. Oh. Here we go. Um, let's just check this one. Slightly longer stream. Let's just do it. Why not? Let's just look around and see who we know now. It's not going to be as confusing as it was before. Yes. Are you... Oh, you're catching that. Makes sense. You're the gunner's mate, after all. There you are. Uh, Thomas, I think it is. Okay, there's Pete. Um, I think the fourth mate, or the third mate, one of them. Um, I think that's Leonard. There are some people. They're, they're the people who disappeared, most likely. Uh, so if I can account for all of these people. Yeah, that's... Oh, you apparently disappeared. Oh, but you're Charles Minor for sure. So, you've got that one down. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, I know who you are. So then the three people who I can't account for in this picture. Um, no, you're somewhere for sure. You're definitely alive. Uh, Nathan Peters. Oh, you're not alive. <laughs> That's the problem. That boat got overturned. I see. Drowned. By a beast. There we go. They never left. They never made it to anywhere. That's what the problem was. And we just busted that, and busted that out quickly. Why can't I talk? Ooh. Nice guess. That wasn't that difficult of a guess, actually. Nice. Should I wrap it up there? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, where can I leave? Um, something I want to adjust though. Okay. Yeah, I got both of those. All four of them. Let's go to the doom. Um. I don't know what his role was. Might have been, yeah, no, it's, it's definitely Cook or Purser, uh, for sure. I'm gonna go with um, a Purser for now. You, 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 you. Um, definitely a Seaman. Sticking with that. Uh, cool. You don't have many people left to guess. Are you possibly Samuel Galligan? No. That's the only other person you can be. You're definitely a steward. I I'm convinced. I'm convinced, man. Let's do a slightly longer stream just because just because I feel like there are some that I can easily pick up here. Um Cook, maybe. Oh wait, I remember. Uh definitely not the cook, maybe the purser. What nationality was the purser? Scottish. No. He was definitely uh, English. Maybe he was Alexander Booth. He can only be Alexander Booth, or uh, maybe he was Claude. Um, or spiked. Actually, that's the word. I'm, that's what probably what the problem is. It is probably the cook. Um, we'll leave that there. And this, who are you? I don't know, but you were playing with an Englishman. Can I see your arm? This is unholy captives. Uh, okay, let's go to that death. I know where that death is. Isn't it this one? <laughs> yeah, know it. Yeah, it is. Yeah, isn't that fortunate? That's that's lucky. Chest 
shell. What shell? Okay, hold on. Who was speaking and when? This is your fault. Let me see that transcript again. Uh, uh, what are these monsters where are they from? You must tell us everything. Uh, we will all die. Is this the first mate or the captain? He is the captain. The surgeon. Uh, these three dead. Surgeon's mate. Yep. Fourth mate, I believe. Uh, that guy. And that guy, as well. Uh, Philip Dole. No, no, uh, John Naples. Um, yeah, I know these people, yeah, that's, uh, the also, uh, I can't remember his name, Lars, that's it, Lars. Anyone else here? I don't know. Uh, no, that's Nathan Peters. Uh, so I went on that full thing. Uh, this is the boson's mate, Charles Minor. There's the boson. So I don't think he spoke at all. Uh, maybe he's he's definitely low level. Uh, maybe he's that person. Uh, spiked or speared? Uh, it's the same cause of death. Oh wait 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 wait. If I go here. You. Hmm. Definitely a seaman. Oh, wait, that's what I wanted to check. I remember now. I want to check your arm. I can't see anything. I can't see your arm. Someone has a very clear tattoo. Some Scottish guy has a very clear tattoo. And it's yet to be revealed. Who that may be. Any other possible nationalities for this guy? Don't think so. Let's go for that one. Then you. Maybe you're Timothy Bow Bo and Beatmon. No, um I have a lot of choice left. Are there any disappearances in this chapter? No. Okay. Are you standing in your photo? He probably is the cook. He's standing by the butcher. Speared, strangled, struck. No. Could be decapitated. By terrible beast. Let me try going back to his, his death so I'm certain about it. Watching the time.
Let me think for a second. Hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna check something. Where is that body? Yeah. This body. We're just running the stream for a little bit longer. So probably about fifteen more minutes and that'll be it. Yeah, okay. No everyone here. Yeah. Yep. I'm looking for who's awake. Anyone out here? No. I feel like the, the cause of death is what I was getting wrong. Okay, this isn't actually the one I wanted, but it's fine because I can do this. Fifty-three isn't there, so it's probably him. Okay, who is here? Who is here that we've identified? We have identified all of you people. Okay, I uh, got you. Got you. Don't have you. You. But you, both of you are here. It'd be nice if I could track you down then. Okay, so let's 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 put a little marker on everyone. Okay, this one's gonna take a little bit of work, but I think we can figure it out for sure. What number is there? Forty-two. Okay, what I really need is the the crew log. There it is. Forty-two. Uh, so we have him. 37. That was 42, yeah. 37. Don't have 37. Yes. 36. Got him. I'm behind him. Cool. Uh, 39. Got him. 40 and 41. 40 and 41. Got both. 38. Got him. 59. I believe that's Brennan. No, it's George Shirley. But we got him anyway, so it doesn't matter. 51. Oh, yeah, no, we definitely have uh, all these fellows. 58. Patrick. Cool. Uh, this is... 57. 57. Ah! This is Alexander Booth. 55. Ah! So I know the ones I'm not sure of. 56. Henry Brennan. Okay. Henry Brennan. Hmm. What discerning features can I find? How lucky I am that they're sleeping with their faces covered. Thing that's very clear. Don't think so. Q 
you are what number 55 let me just double check 55 is a guy from sierra leona anyone else sleeping here nah didn't think so you guys are probably all friends then uh you wear these shoes and look and you have that tattoo it's on your left arm hmm who would that be and you're sitting next to what was it uh 37 no you are 37 it was a 42 I think it was so Nicholas Bottrell Nicholas Bottrell was a top man uh you're also a top man probably yeah top man someone who Nicholas Bottrell what did you look like probably up here Hmm. You were Scottish, weren't you? No, not that Scottish. Yeah. I knew we could get some more. Who did we get? Yes. Yes. Means that was Alexander Booth. Precisely. Okay. I say we have nine more minutes on the stream. Um, probably the purser. I think what I'm getting wrong is the cause of death for some of these people. Maybe not spiked, but maybe speared by a terrible beast. Um, and yeah, he's definitely the chef. I don't quite what's make out what's going on there. Uh, whoops. Um. Yeah, this is the one. That, this is definitely Samuel Galligan. But uh, maybe he wasn't strangled. Maybe he was struck. No. Maybe he was. No, he wasn't poisoned. Uh. No. Oh, there's also fell overboard. I haven't even hadn't even seen that one. Um, maybe he was clawed. Oh, okay, wait, clawed can only be defined by that. Um, Can I see his death? Good photo. That guy screams help. Um... I feel like I need to double check that one. Who else? Okay, now, so I'm pretty close to getting all of them. Um, really just those, those ones that I need to figure out.
If I could study that scene just a little closer, maybe that would give me my... Give me what I need to know. Um, cool. I think we're about to do all the ones that we can. We only really have th we only have three that we can finish solving right now. Um, and this death occurred, I'm trying to remember where. I think it was wasn't here. I think it was here. This way. Yeah. This is the one of the ones I want to check. Oh, wait, we have four left. At least four. I want to see exactly what the cause of death was here. Definitely the cook. I was right from the get-go. Maybe you could say he was... clubbed. It wasn't spiked, he was like just solidly smacked. Yeah, so struck by a uh struck by tail, obviously. Obviously, should have got that from the from the start. Struck tail. There we go. Yes. Ah yes, he was the purser. What was the other one? You only showed me two. You only showed me two. <laughs> right? Didn't you? Maybe you died by some other thing. Did it not just give me, did it not just only reveal two things to me? Okay, well I want to leave now. Um, maybe if I just check at one other death, I can be certain about how it happened. It was on this, no, where was it? It wasn't here. It was, uh, how do I get there? Oh wait, I know, I know. We'll walk this way. It, this game, it, it's been uh, a great experience, just like that feeling of revelation, like uh, when something suddenly becomes clear to you. That's exactly what elucidation means. I'm just repeating myself. Um, how were you killed exactly? Oh, maybe he got shot. I'd like to look around. It looks like there was a bit of a misfire. Oh, I can't. That's not... That's great. That's great, dude. So maybe he got shot by someone. None of these legs are quite reaching here. 
Is there anyone who's firing in this direction? Yeah, this guy missed. So he was shot. But by whom? It's a little hard to make him out from here, but I think it's Charles Minor. This is the first mate. Maybe I can figure it out by just going to this death here. It was around that area. There's a death uh, here. Where? Come on, help. Let me go here. Let me just quickly check who was standing in that area. And I think that will help. I think it was Charles Minor in that. I'll remember that. Yeah, I'm not too interested. Who was standing? Uh, can't check. Okay, so I guess I'll just have to guess. Yeah, I think it was Charles Minor. He was. Oh, he had already been. He had already been stabbed. Ah, uh, he was spiked. Can't you see? Following the blood trail. Yeah, he did get spiked. He was he was definitely oh well, maybe he was also shot though. Yeah, because it was blood that just shot that way. Let's, let's just say it was Charles Minor. Let's try that. Um It's a bit of a weird one. Arrows didn't really play a part in this. Uh, I think it was... Charles Minor. I think. Not sure. Was he, he was bleeding out, yes. Also, uh, did I hear a gunshot? Not sure I did. Let me just check again. <laughs> the stream's going for quite a bit longer than I intended. Mm hmm. Definitely something happened there. I don't think it was j just throwing around spikes. I think it was definitely someone shooting it. And missing. Okay, there are those two. <laughs> that also would have confirmed that they're the gunners. I think it was him missing. So, who is th who's there? Um, not really accounted for. Accounted for, accounted for. Uh, definitely wouldn't be shooting. Um, it's not one of these two. Might be one of these two, not the surgeon. Uh, it could be a um, ghoul. It's a little hard to make out. Where are you? No, I can't see his hat.
So that's the things. I'm gonna get a good angle here. Pretty tough though. There he is. Too many boxes in the way. Not helpful. There's the surgeon. Mounted for. One of the midshipmen, I believe. Uh, surgeon. No, I think it was uh, Charles Minor. I think this is just a poor case of him having been shot by that guy. So don't think this thing's arm is reaching. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is actually Charles Minor. Where are you? Um then for this I'm gonna stick with strangled or oh, what else is there? Uh clubbed, clawed, burnt, axed, no, 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 no. And carrying a sword. Uh I think strangled by uh, I can't remember his name now. It being uh so yeah. Then who else do I need to Otherwise, I'll throw in the towel, towel now if I can't immediately fix it. Wait, wait, it would be faster if I just did this. Uh, okay, third mate, he already dies in the bargain. The doll dies in the lazarette somehow. Oh, so I can't. I actually can't confirm them. Okay, well then that's where we're going to end it off for today. <laughs> I wasted some time there towards the end. Unfortunately. So yeah, that's going to be it. I wasted quite a bit of time, but uh, at least now we know for certain that we've done everything that we possibly can for now. Uh, and we've run way over time. So... Uh, I guess next week, yeah, I suppose next week we'll, um, return to this, uh, boat on the side, and we'll see what clues we uncover from doing that. Uh, in the meantime, I hope you enjoyed, and, oh, what's this? Okay, well, just nothing then. Um, I hope you enjoyed. And have a good day. That's really it. Thank you so much for watching again. And goodbye. Okay, my scene didn't change. I have to do this. There we go. Uh, this one. And then... Thank you, everyone.